Hi everyone, I went to Rite Aid last night and today, so I've got a lot of stuff to show you and tell you about, so I'm going to get on it. So last night I got, now Michelle from Michelle's Frugal Living told us about this deal. Um, these are the Clear Eyes Pure Relief, and they are $13.49, buy one get one free. And then there's $4 coupons from coupons.com. So after, and they are part of Points Blizzard, and they're part of Allergy Rewards. So after you factor all that in, they're like a $3 and something money maker. So fabulous, fabulous deal on that. I needed to finish off my Points Blizzard on this card, so this is what I got. The Garnier Shampoo was $3.50. They're two for $7. You have to buy two to get that price. So I had a $2 off coupon on the shampoo and a $2 coupon on the hairspray. I have a Saving Star $2 rebate on a styling product, so I should get that back. So on this tiny little haul, I spent like $10.08 of point money, and I got $10 in point money back. No real money at all, so that was fabulous. Then I noticed, so I finished that card off, then I noticed that these were on a clearance rack in the back. The 75% off clearance rack, and they're marked $7.99, so 75% off that is $1.99. And I had $2 off coupons. The first $2 coupon worked fine, the second one beat because I forgot that sometimes you need something to cover overage. So I was at the checkout and I got all nervous because when I go in the store to Rite Aid, there's nobody in the checkout line until the moment I get up there. Then all of a sudden, 12 people are in line behind me. So I had to grab this because that was the cheapest thing at the checkout that I could get. It was 63 cents. So 63 cents plus whatever tax in that was like 91 cents of real money I had to pay. But they did count for points blizzard, so that was exciting. I would have much rather had Fig Newtons or a can of tomatoes. But that's what I had to do, so that's okay. And then today, I went back to that store. When I went last night, they had four of those. Today, they only had one. I dug up more coupons, but I could only find one. So I got one. So it was $1.99. It had a $2 coupon, and it counted for points blizzard. And then the clear eyes, I got two more of those because I had two more $4 coupons. So, um, so I got those. They counted for points blizzard also. They didn't have they didn't have six boxes of special K at that store. So I had to go to another one and I needed to get them in increments of six because this is the way to maximize the deal and this is what I did and why I did this. So they're buy one, get one free. That's the store sale. And then I have manufacturer coupons that I printed from coupons.com, which are buy two, get one free. So that's why you have to get six. So and then I got to buy two, get one free. So I got six. And so there's a lot of math here involved, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go through it with you, but you're going to have to stay with me because it, it gets complicated. So they're $5.29 for the first one. The second one's free, $5.29. The other one's free, $5.29. That one's free. So that's a total of $15.87. Now the points blizzard equivalent would be $5.23 that you subtract from that. The buy two, get one free takes off $3.99. That's the maximum value on the coupon. doesn't matter when you scan your card. That's all it's going to take off. So those two came off. Then I had two $1 off two manufacturer coupons on the two that I bought and the other two that I bought. And then those two were the ones I got free with the coupon. So that makes it $0.66 cents for six boxes of cereal or approximately $0.10 cents each. Or you can look at it like this. E equals mc squared times the square root of pi times sine and cosine equals the derivative of pi squared. And that's divided by the sum of all things. So I hope that was very, very clear to you on the math. <laughs> I crack myself up with my math. My husband, he's an engineer. And he uses math in his job every day. So he just laughs at me when I start talking this crazy big word math stuff that I'm thinking I'm impressing him with my math and everything and he just laughs at me. And then my oldest daughter, she's getting her master's degree in computer science, so she uses math every day and she laughs at me too because I try to 
I try to say stuff like the square root of pi and all that. There is no such thing. They tell me, there is no such thing, Mom. You don't even know what you're talking about. So, anyway, speaking of um, my oldest daughter, though, and I know I need cereal like I need a hole in the head. I get that. I showed you my um, pantry, and I have a ton of cereal, but she came over on Monday, and she shopped my pantry and took a whole bunch of cereal to her apartment, so I'm super excited because a lot of my cereal got cleared out, and I was excited to get, and this is my favorite cereal anyway, um, and my youngest daughter loves it too because it's vegan. There's no milk products in it at all. With some of the Special K products, you have to be careful because they do have protein in them, and the protein that they get is derived from whey, which is a milk protein, so therefore most Special K cereals are not vegan, but these are. So, And plus they're delicious. I just love them. They are so, so, so good. I love the cro coconut cranberry almond and also the apple raspberry almond. They're yummy, delicious. So for $0.10 cents each... When they're regular $5.29, oh yeah, I'm all up in it. Pantry challenge or not, I'm paying $0.10 cents each for six boxes of cereal. Absolutely. Okay, and then Ravi told us about this deal. The Clarence Band-Aids. Okay, Ravi Patel, he's on YouTube. Go watch him. He does fabulous Rite Aid hauls. So these are $0.87, cents, $0.87, cents, and this one's $1.24. I had $4 off three coupons that I found in previous bags, not in this bag, but I had some from other bags that I'd gotten. And then this had a coupon to get it free. So she took it off and she scanned it and it took off $4.99 even though the bag rang at $3.99. So I got a dollar overage on that and a, almost a dollar overage on that. So that was exciting. And then the Advil menstrual pain was $3.99, and I had a $2 off coupon, and there's a $2 saving star rebate also. Now, I'm done with this part of my life, so I don't need this, but I have two daughters, and they will be thrilled to get it. So it was exciting to get that for free. So on this haul, I spent $0.08 cents of real money, and I don't remember how many points I spent. I think with that haul and this one, I spent about 1300 in points, but I did get my 1000 back for my first spend 30, get 1000 back, and I have almost $10 towards my next 30, get 10 back, which I need to think of something that isn't going to cost me too much because I only have 1000 points to spend on this card to get my next 1000 and I don't want to spend any real money, so yeah. So that's what I got today. I thank you all so much for watching, and we will see you on the next video. Bye, everybody.